three homing torpedoes, just like weapons does. But you don't steal his torpedoes. Every time you dock and relaunch, you get three more torpedoes. Magic. <laughs> we all know about magic. Indeed. <laughs> Here we have our weapons console. You make sure that when you arrive at the destination deemed by the captain, we bring the pain. Turn the big ships in small pieces. You have an array of different types of uh, missiles available. The two that you want to use the most are EMTs, to scramble the enemy shields, and nukes, which pretty much scrambles the enemy ships. We call this shake and bake. <laughs> Fire that into the middle of a cluster of enemies and their toast. You'll see enemies come into range at about 5,000 K on the 5,000 in range. Tap to lock and fire a missile. Don't throw them out there without locking them. They will go find something on their own. They don't care what they see. If it's a ship, they go for it. You might do the fighter, get your own base, lock before you launch. Over here we have engineering. Anyone ever overclock a PC for more speed? You can overclock the ship. <laughs> Anyone kill a PC because you overclocked it? You can kill the ship. You have a limited amount of cooling, just like overclocking the PC. You have a ridiculous amount of energy with which to cook the ship. <coughs> we do have a cheat sheet, some engineering presets. These are the number keys across the front row. These have been carefully crafted to get you a quick start. When the captain says, let's roll, you know, take us out, number six, you press that, it do some maneuvering and warp speed. Um, there's one for beam combat. Boost the beam weapons, boost the front shields. One for torpedo combat. Get those torpedoes loaded faster. If anything's going too slow, it's this guy's fault. <laughs> the ship isn't turning fast enough, quick boost to maneuvering so we get turned around and bring it back down. There is a heat, a little heat gauge at the top of each one of the power bars. Keep it cranked up too high, too long, it'll cook that system and damage it. Bring down the heat, put them over the cooling. The coolant's not consumed, you're routing of it here. And finally, over here at Helm, you get the fancy controller. Uh, this is throttle, 100% to 0% impulse normal maneuvering speed for combat. Pull the trigger for warp one. You pull it to hold it, when you release, you coast back to normal speed. On the touch screen, anything that says planar is a touch screen. These are points, they'll sail. Hit them like you mean it, they'll take the beating. you'll be using up here, there's a reverse to go into the reverse. You can't warp in reverse. Oh. <laughs> Turn reverse off. Yeah. Warp one. <laughs> Not a happy time, especially if you just drop the mine. <laughs> and you're trying to get away from it. Uh, you also have request docking. Move up close to a station within 500 units. Hit request docking, you hit tractors you in and you need to recharge. Take the throttle down to zero. You throttle up, they assume you're leaving. And off you go. Throttle down. Laptop not on touch screen, by the way. To launch the fighter, you can use the annoying tablet pad or I can find you a dog. <coughs> That's a quick overview of what all the stations are capable of. Roll your second side and die and pick a station or settle up to a thumb wrestling. Or sit down and take one. Yep. <laughs> take the sight. Pick one.